What's up guys? So this is education about stuff. It's been a while. Um, this video series is going to be about C sharp. So we're just going to start out with some terminology that I'll be using. This video is really meant to just catch up the beginners and then we'll be ready to start coding in the next video. So the console is a text only interface. It's uh, kind of like a command prompt window or a DOS window. It's text only and that's it. GUI is a graphical user interface. It's things like buttons, menus, other visuals. It's pretty much every program that you'd use. A component or a control are the items within a GUI, like buttons, menus, that kind of thing. Cross-platform just means that it's like an application or code that works on Windows, Mac, and Linux systems. The framework is just a set of tools that a programming language can work with, so like the .NET framework. Alright, so now is the time that we're going to open up Visual Studio, so if you haven't downloaded it, please do so now, and then open it up. Alright, so this is what Visual Studio looks like. My copy is the Enterprise copy, but you guys will likely be using the Community copy. They're essentially the same for our purposes. Um, but let's get started right away. Let's finish up this video. So uh, you can start a new project in a couple ways. You can do so by hitting New Project up here in the Start menu. If we're going to File, New, and then Project. <clears throat> There's a lot of templates here. Uh, the only ones that we'll be concerned with right now are the console application and the Windows Forms application. I may touch on the WPF application later on. If you're ever in trouble finding these specific templates, just remember to click Visual C Sharp on the left tree here, and then Windows, and then Classic Desktop. You can also select the target framework. I like keeping mine at four. That's just personal preference. Um, but for these videos, you can use anything after 4 if you like. It's really up to you. Okay, so just to give you guys an idea of what's coming in the next video, uh, we're going to be doing a console application. Uh, just something very basic to uh, give you guys an introduction so you can get a feel for it. And uh, yeah, we'll start coding, so <laughs> get excited. Just so you know what to expect in future videos as well, um, I'd like to make this series more or less project based. So every few videos um, we'll be going into uh, like a project together and um, we'll code it from start to finish all in one video. It might be a long video, it might be a short video, it'll depend. So I hope that works out for you guys. Um, I'm also going to try to get at least one video out a week. I don't really know what sort of timeline I'm on, but uh, stay tuned. I will finish the series eventually. <laughs> okay, well anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, feel free to thumb up and subscribe. If you have any co uh, questions or comments, feel free to just put that in the comment section below.